Hi, I'm Mark Hemmelstein, the Chief Technology Officer for RISC-5 International, and welcome to our yearly awards. And so without further ado, uh, our first set of awards are for our founders, uh, Innovation Founders Awards. Uh, while a huge number of people contributed to RISC-5, uh, we have some founders who, who helped start it at Berkeley and help you know, get it uh, sedimented into being an open source hardware project and are responsible for any success that we have seen today. So uh, Krista, uh, sort of the, the, the big godfather for RISC-5, uh, he is the chairman for the, for the PRIV spec. Uh, he is uh, also uh, driving uh, things like fast interrupts and helping with bit manipulation and driving vectors. So uh, a lot of great work by Krista. Um, he is also helping us figure out how to govern and scale the organization. Uh, so that we create robust extensions and uh, make good progress with them in a timely fashion. Uh, Dave Patterson is, is uh, one of the godfathers of risk period. And so uh, he was involved in all the major risk architectures that uh, have occurred and uh, understands architecture incredibly well, works both in industry and in academia and is there as our uh, great advisor who just has done it before and understands things at a very fundamental level um, and has also helped us uh, increase our governance. Uh, Yensip Lee is the head of the steering committee that uh, drives all the technical groups inside of RISC-5 International. Um, and he has been a pleasure to work with in order to, again, to uh, you know, uh, get extensions over the finish line, to uh, set uh, goals from a top-down level uh, so that we uh, you know, know where we're going. Uh, and to uh, increase the scalability and the governance of the organization. Uh, Andrew uh, uh, is in almost every technical discussion. He runs the, the PRIV uh, uh, specification and uh, uh, along with, with uh, one of our uh, other members that, that we're going to talk about shortly. Uh, but, you know, it doesn't make a difference what the topic is, whether it's uh, an unpriv thing like BIMINIP or um, details like virtual memory with inside PRIV. Uh, he has great advice, great experience, and um, again, um, uh, his fingerprint is all over uh, where we're heading, and, um, and it's a good fingerprint, so we're grateful for him. Uh, John Hauser worked on the original floating point implementation uh, and is now uh, spearheading some of the hypervisor work, so we're very grateful to John for that as well. Thank you for all of our innovation leaders, uh, and now we'll go on to, to some other leaders in the organization. Uh, so the top uh, technical contributors, um, so uh, Jeremy Bennett from Evacosm, uh, who uh, has taken on the code speed uh, um, uh, SIG, um, also drives the mBench benchmark, um, always looking after RISC-V's uh, interests, uh, you know, joining us in general in the software uh, world, uh, you know, inside of our organization uh, to make sure that we're doing things in a robust fashion. Uh, Gaj um, drove the, 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 the trace uh, uh, stuff for, for, for instructions and got it ratified, uh, and we're very excited about that. Uh, he also, again, is, is playing a big role in uh, a bunch of other groups to make sure that we're crossing our, our T's and dotting our I's. Shenhua Cheng is uh, the vice chair of the, uh, um, of the UMPRIV spec, uh, also involved in uh, very heavily in the PACT SIMD extension, uh, and again, uh, showing up in a number of places uh, to help us go ahead and have a robust uh, uh, set of extensions. Greg Favor uh, is, in, is sort of taken on uh, new responsibilities this year um, and is the co-chair for the PRIV spec, uh, but also everywhere, virtual memory, uh, cache management operations, bit manipulation, so on and so forth. Uh, he's there with, again, great experience, great advice, and we're very grateful for that. He also wrote the fast track policy, which enables us to go ahead and put small extensions through in a, in a rapid fashion. And then finally, Alan Baum, who uh, is in every single meeting, has great uh, continuity between them. He got the, uh, the next generation of our test uh, effort uh, underway and working with a third party to put the initial uh, tests in place, uh, continuing to spearhead that and drive the ISA infrastructure, which includes things like formal model and documentation and 
uh, architectural tests and, and uh, testing and regression testing and, and continuous integration. So I want to thank all these people. Uh, let's raise a virtual hand and clap. Uh, and now I'll hand it over to Krista for the big award. Hi, Krista here. Um, I'm delighted to be here in my role as chairman of the board um, to present the annual Technical Leadership Award from the Board of Directors for 2020. Uh, so this award is given in recognition of profound technical contribution and leadership in collaboration across the RISC-V community to further technical progress and industry adoption. So I'm like to, delighted to say that this year's winner is um, uh, Claire Wolf, uh, and uh, she's well known for her within the RISC V community for her contributions and leadership in creating the bit manipulation spec, um, as well as very active roles in the, the crypto group, the formal group, and uh, the compliance technical groups. Um, outside of RISC V, uh, Claire is really well known as a leader in the uh, emerging open source EDA tools ecosystem. Many contributions there, including the Theosis synthesis system. Uh, so very highly deserved and uh, um, very glad to be able to present this award to, to Claire.